Hi, baby girl. It is me, and I am making you the video that I promised you. Um, I didn't make it yesterday because I had upset you, and I didn't want this to seem like um me trying to make this an apology as opposed to an actual apology. So this is for when you're in a good mood, when you're ready to enjoy. My boy, whatever. That sounds very vain. I'm not trying to be vain. But I am going to read you three poems that you sent me. The first is titled Convalescence by Amy Lowell. From out the dragging vastness of the sea, wave fettered, bound in sinuous seaweed strands, he toils toward the rounding beach and stands, one moment, white and dripping, silently, cut like a cameo in lazuli then falls, betrayed by shifting shells, and lands prone in the jeering water, and his hands clutch for support where no support can be. So up and down and forward, inch by inch, he gains upon the shore, where poppies glow and sandflies dance their little lives away. The second waves retard, and tighter clinch the weeds about him, but the land winds blow, and in the sky there blooms the sun many. Second is titled, You Are My Death, unknown author. I don't know if you know the author, but it's not here. You are my death, you I could hold when all fell away from me. And the third is a poem by Rabindranath Tagore. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that well. I don't know who I'm apologizing to. I dreamt that she sat by my head, tenderly ruffling my hair with her fingers, playing the melody of her touch. I looked at her face and struggled with my tears till the agony of unspoken words burst my sleep like a bubble. I sat up and saw the glow of the Milky Way above my window, like a world of silence on fire, and I wondered if at this moment she had a dream that rhymed with mine. Those are all three very cool. I'm going to have to say that my favorite is the Rabindranath Tagore one, because that, that last line is fucking amazing. Damn, that's good. Um, yes. And of course, you asked me to call you Baby Girl, which is your name. Um, one of your many names, among one of the nice ones, and I'm not going to say the mean ones right now, the, the naughty ones, rather. The rougher ones. Um, I am very sick still, my stomach feels bad, and I'm stuffed up. Look how many Kleenex. It's all Kleenex. And one fell on the ground, and that's gross. Um, and I have to go wash my hands now. Uh, yes. I love you a lot. Um, I'm sorry for what I did yesterday, and I will, I will never do that again. I will always accommodate you. And I know that you're you're into being dominated and being told and manipulated as as I need you to be, and I will do that within the boundaries that are healthy for you. And I love you, and I hope I can prove to you that I am not a bad person and that I will not hurt you. I think my puppy is sleeping. Do you see her? There she is. Can you hear her? Let's see. I don't know if you can hear her, but she's very cute, and I love you a lot, and I hope, um, I hope you can forgive me for what I did. I love you.